What's good everybody? Welcome to today's video, today's vlog. Just arrived here in El Paso, Texas, guys, after a long day of flying. I'm here for the Army, but I wanted to bring the camera and just record, guys. Bring you guys along, man. I've been traveling a lot, and I have not been recording, and I feel like it's very important to record this stuff, you know? Even for when I want to go back years from now and watch these videos. But anyways, if you're new to the channel, my name is Lane Jackson. This channel is called Lane Jackson Fitness. On this channel, guys, you can find things about fitness, food, firefighting, and of course, traveling, all right? So, we're here for the Army. This actually makes my third trip to El Paso, and I actually love El Paso, guys. So, decided to bring the camera. I'm just gonna record, get some footage, and we're just gonna roll with it, all right? So, give you guys a quick rundown of the room, thanks to the Army. So, have a kitchen area right here, which I probably won't be using, because I'm only here for like four days. Um, we have the dining room slash living room area. Then you have the bedroom. Went ahead and got my uniform ready for tomorrow. I always like to be organized, guys. I've always been like that ever since I was young. I always used to lay my school clothes out. <laughs> so I got my uniform ready to go for tomorrow. Got my backpack. Show you guys the bathroom. Um, it's a really big bathroom open. Uh, but other than that, guys, it's a pretty basic room. The room is actually here on the Army base, which is Fort Bliss, guys. So I think we're getting ready to head out, get some dinner, and I will check back in with you guys later, all right? All right, everyone, so we've been hiking for about 40 minutes, trying to head up there to Mammoth Mountain here in El Paso. And I think we're gonna turn around. Uh, we're not gonna push our rookie luck. <laughs> it push our beginner's luck, so. Um, how far y'all think we're up? Too damn far. <laughs> so. It's actually a beautiful scenery. Give you guys a look here. Make sure I don't slip. As you guys can see, the view is beautiful. Here in El Paso, Texas, this is actually my first time hiking like this, guys. So, definitely a great experience. Not looking forward to going back down. It's gonna be a challenge, but we're gonna get ready to turn around because we don't wanna get stuck out here at night. So. Yeah, we're gonna get ready to do that. So if you come to El Paso, definitely try it out. Um, gonna have to rescue this guy here in a minute. All right, y'all, so it's about 6 a.m. here in the morning in El Paso, guys, which means it's 8 o'clock a.m. in New Jersey, New York. So I've been up because my body's used to waking up early, but we're actually getting ready to do some fasted cardio. Being that this channel is about fitness, I want to incorporate some fitness in this video. So yesterday, we went hiking, and I'm not going to lie, guys, I probably burned a ton of calories. It's a really good workout. It's my first time hiking. Great experience. Uh, when I travel, guys, I definitely like to try new things. So. Definitely got a good workout in yesterday. Um, this morning we're gonna get up and do some fasted cardio, fasted abs, and we may do fasted weight training depending on my time frame, all right? But I wanted to bring you guys along because yesterday on my IG stories I talked about cardio and I feel like I need to talk about it on this channel and get the information out to you guys on this channel. So when we get down there, we're gonna do the cardio and I'm gonna talk to you guys about cardio in my opinion, and things you can do to improve your cardio sessions, all right? So before we get down there or head down there, guys, we are going to have 
one scoop of branch chain amino acids. The one I'm using right now is Platinum Amino Energy from Muscle Tech, the Extreme Orange, which tastes phenomenal, guys. So what I like to do is basically fill my shaker cup all the way up because I sip on this. I'll drink some of it before we get started and then I'll drink some of it during the workout. Fill the shaker cup all the way up, all the way to the top of water. And then I just put one scoop of aminos in there. Some people do two. I feel like one scoop is good enough because it doesn't make it really sweet, all right? Um, so we're gonna head down, do the cardio, come back, and we're gonna have our first meal for the day, which will be a protein shake. Show you guys that as well. Also guys, if you're interested in any Muscle Tech products, all you gotta do is click the link in the description, shopmusletech.com, and to save some money, make sure you put in promo code LANE10, all right? So let's go ahead, put your shoes on, get your shaker cup, get your BCAs. Let's head on down, get this cardio started. So just completed 45 minutes of fasted cardio. I'm actually on my cool down guys. I originally recorded a clip but I decided to do another take because it was just real shaky. I was trying to catch my breath but caught my breath, cooling down, did 45 minutes fasted. But I want to talk to you guys about cardio. So when you're doing fasted cardio, any type of cardio, post-workout cardio or cardio just in general guys, you know time after time I go to the gym and I see people leaning on the treadmill, holding the rails, leaning on the Stairmaster, holding the rails, and they'll have the speed, the incline, everything as high as it can go. You're not getting the most out of your workout, guys, doing that. So I encourage you guys to lower the settings, lower the inclines, get at a comfortable speed, resistance, whatever the case may be, whatever your machine you're using, and try to perform or try to complete your cardio session without holding onto the handrails, all right? At the end of the day, guys, you're gonna get more out of that session. You're probably gonna burn a lot more calories than the screen is actually telling you guys because the screen is not accurate. And you're just gonna get 110% out of that session. When, you, when you're holding onto the handrails, you're taking away from that session, you're only gonna get 70% of that cardio session, all right? So today, I actually had this at 13, but like I said, I'm cooling down, and then I have my speed at 2.7 and I did 45 minutes walking. Now occasionally guys, I will hold the um, heart rate monitor so I can check my heart rate to make sure that I am in my target heart, fat burning uh, heart rate zone, all right? So that's like the only time I really hold on the handrails. Now if you have some physical or, or physical or health issue that requires you to hold on to the handrails, by all means do that. But if you don't guys, don't shortchange yourself. Don't shortchange your cardio session and let go of the handrails, lower the speed, lower the incline, find a comfortable position and walk. Or if you're on a treadmill, climb on the treadmill without holding onto the handrails. Trust me, you'll burn a lot more calories and you're gonna get 100% of that cardio session, all right? So we're gonna go ahead and do a few weight, weight, not weighted, <laughs> body weight ab exercises, all right?
I just had a protein shake, which was meal number one, guys, using this new protein powder from Muscle Tech. I wanted to share this, share this protein with you guys because, guys, let me tell you, this is probably the purest protein on the market right now. Coming in at only 100 calories per serving, less than one gram of carbs, zero grams of sugar, and 25 grams of protein per serving. You cannot beat it, guys. This protein is very good if you're on competition prep, if you're dieting, or if you're just looking for a solid meal replacement slash post-workout meal, guys. So if you're interested in this protein, definitely click the link in the description, shopmusletech.com, guys, and put in promo code LANE10 to save some money. Ugh. <sighs> 